Hi Lee, I just wanted to prepare a short tutorial for you. Um, uh, our phone call we had the other day uh, was it, with, in regards to table press and how to add that short code. So I'm going to show you real quickly here. I'm logged into the back end and if you go over here to table press and click on all tables and then go down here to, um, let me see here, it looks like you've added these three right here. Uh, SGF to Lake the Ozarks area, HRO and JLN. And you want to add those to that page where you have all of the other tables. You simply go up here and you go to show short code. And then uh, with that highlighted, you don't have to do anything, but uh, I think you're on Windows probably, so do a, a Control C to copy. Or if you're on a Mac, Command C. And then hit OK and then go back to pages and click on all pages and then you'll want to go down to um, airport transfers I believe it is and click on edit with Divi <coughs> sorry about the interruption it was bring your dogs to work day today so <clears throat> I'm gonna let this uh, load here. What I want to do is, is uh, click on this module settings gear right here. And then you can see all of these um, short codes beneath each heading. Okay. So the next one I think would probably be, uh, and, and let me click on this and go up here. That's a heading two tag that I've been using. So um, we want to um, basically hit return here and then type in whatever the heading is uh, S, was it I'm doing this from memory so SGF to Lake of the Ozarks area and then hit return again and you can click anywhere along this line here and go up here and you want to make that a heading two tag so it looks like that and then paste that short code right there Okay, and then you'll hit this uh, save changes check mark here, and then these three dots, and hit save there. And then if we go down, you'll see that that has been added. Now, I noticed that you have the show 10 entries and the search bar and all that kind of stuff. Let me go back to the table press and and explain to you how to get rid of those because that's not necessary these tables are so small you don't need to do a search or anything and certainly want to keep it consistent with everything else that's going on here so I'm gonna go back to the dashboard by going up here to the upper left hand corner going down to table press all tables and I'm gonna go down to this uh, SGF to like those arcs area and I'm gonna click on edit and then I want to scroll down here and in this area where it says features of the database JavaScript library um, we're going to deselect that right there where it says use the following features of the data tables JavaScript library with this table that gets rid of all the sorting and all that jazz that is not necessary because it's not a complex table so you'll click on save changes and then we'll go back to visit site and if we go to uh, airport transfers and we scroll down you'll see now that those little boxes are gone the search box and, and sorting and all that jazz so I'm gonna stop right there um, I'll let you add the other two in so you can get a feel for what it what it's like to do that if you have any questions whatsoever as always give me a call shoot me an email uh, text me whatever you want to do and I'll be more than happy to help you Hope you have a great evening, and we'll talk to you soon. Thanks.